na governor mama Susan na watoto naibu wa rais ma ka viongozi wa kanisa na wambolezaji wote ambao wamefika hapa bwana asifiwe bwana asifiwe andua kabete muriega yeah um i have come to mourn a friend george muchai was a good friend of mine and we've known each other for a very long time i met him when he was still working with elliot then later on he went on to the trade union movement so we've been together for a very long time and as has been said by those who have spoken before George was a very straightforward person somebody who loved his country a true Kenyan patriot i have had occasion to deal with him as a trade unionist when i was in government and one time they came to see me with the secretary general of kotu to invite me to be the special guest at the labor day and once i accepted then they came to tell me that you know you are coming but you must tell us what package you are bringing to workers <laughs> so i told him george you know this is a trick <laughs> oh you know if you must come at least they were expecting 100% but <laughs> something you cannot just come empty handed i told him, this is a trick this is very fair um so he's somebody i know very well and i was very shocked that early morning when i got the news that george had been executed on the streets of nairobi i sent a message but I was out of town but within four hours I was in town and I went to the Lee funeral home and I found the four bodies lying there it was a gory sight to behold George was probably the better of the four bodies there it was something that you know was now sitting that a member of parliament and his security could be gunned down you know gangland like in the center of the city this the cbd area then of course um, uh, there after a lot of information has come out and i can see people have spoken here a lot of emotions now they said yeah this is the cctv yes you have cctv which are installed in town then the story of cctv there's a county government and then there's the police i don't know where i li had lived in the us cctv close circuit television is something that is dynamic is moving all the times when this kind of incident is taking place the command center should be seeing and monitoring what's happening and communicating with the patrol on the road <laughs> when you're being told that oh the county government has handed over their films to the to the police you see, what is happening can somebody come and tell kenyans why we spent so much money installing cctv if they cannot be used in order to deal with the criminals on instant at times like this emotions rise and run very high na nimesikia wale ambao wamesemeka lakini uchunguzi ya vitendo kama haya mpaka ifanyike professionally let those who are doing investigations come up with proper evidence that will incriminate those who are involved in this plot let us not be left to laymen making allegations against so and so so and so so and so 
I happen to have lost a relative recently in a, a very bizarre way. But I said, let it, there be no speculations. Let there be proper, thorough, professional investigations to tell us who planned, not just who gunned him down, but who was behind planning of this execution. Who was behind it? Let those people be arrested and be brought to book. Let us not just say, you can run, but you, can, you cannot escape, we will find you. We leave no stones unturned. Those Kenyans are used to. But now in conclusion, let me say this. This country needs healing process. We need to find a way of talking to each other as Kenyans and dealing with our past so that we can reconcile our society. Reconcile Kenya so that Kenya can move together as one nation. This is very important. George, yes, was a great enemy of an animal called corruption, Ufisadi, Ufisadi. But let's not just talk about Ufisadi, to Tamaliza, to Tapigana Ufisadi. When we see it, nothing is had done. We have got chicken gate. What do we call a cuckoo? Kule ingereza, wameshika watu, wamewekwa ndani, miaka mitatu. Ati walikuwa mpea rusha kwa watu wa Kenya hapa. Hapa wanambiwa, tu wanafanya uchunguzi. Ya tujapato ushahidi. Ushahidi kani wanaitaji. Kama wa ingreza, wamefanya uchunguzi. Wamezema watu hawa, walitua rusha kwa watu kule Kenya. Show Kenyans by action. Umekula kuku, sasa kuenda kule, kule maragwe. Na nizi yuko. Asante nisani. The Lord bless you. Mr. Speaker, sir. Mheshimiwa Makamu Rais ni ruhusu kabla ya Mheshimiwa Speaker kwa ruksa yako nimesahau kulete lambirambi kwa Susan na jamii kutoka kwa gavana wa jiji la Nairobi na jumuiya ya magavana wote katika nchi yetu ya Kenya. Asante na samahani.